everyone. I'm Kay Bear. I've got a question for you. What's your idea of paradise? Are you planning a kayaking trip to the Florida Keys? If peace, serenity, and crystal clear water is what you're looking for on your next kayaking trip, then keep watching. show you one of the Florida Keys best kept secrets and you can get to it by kayak. So stay tuned and you're watching Two Bears Outdoors. <laughs> Curry Hammock State Park provides a beautiful, pristine Keys natural wilderness with beach areas on the Atlantic side. But not everyone that comes to Curry Hammock State Park knows of a particular location that is only accessed by boats and it's a hot spot that the locals know about. They call it a gem, a beautiful Keys paradise. It's Curry Hammock State Park's best kept secret. Curry Hammock State Park is located on the north end of Marathon Key. The park does not allow motorboats, only kayaks and paddleboards. Entering the park on the north side of the property, there's a kayak launch next to the park's fabulous beach area. A lot of people go kayaking here, but most have no idea about the beautiful sandbar, also known as Marathon Sandbar, that's just a short quarter mile paddle northeast of the park and just a little bit north of Valhalla Island. The paddle should take you no more than half an hour in calm conditions. It's normally not a difficult paddle, however, it all depends on the weather. Most of the time, you will experience some wind and strong currents on your trip. The changing of the tide can be witnessed in greater detail at Marathon Sandbar. White sandy bottom is exposed when the tide is going out and it creates scattered pockets and tide pools. Besides the beautiful scenery, marine life abounds on this sandbar. During the week, there's usually not that many people, and you can possibly even have it all to yourself. But on the weekends and holidays, a lot of the locals will come out and anchor in their boats on the edge of the sandbar. However, this sandbar is very large and it has a wide range of shallow areas that can only be accessed by kayaks.
Nation. Um, we just got here today and um, brought our little pup with us and we're just kind of chilling. I guess it's about the same. Beautiful conch shell with the actual conch inside. <laughs> Both of them have inhabitants. And something that I just found. Look at this, guys how beautiful this starfish and you find them all over the flats out here folks now of course you got a lot of predatory fish that will come out to the flats to feed uh, bonefish redfish sharks stingrays barracudas uh, you name it you'll find it all out here in other words on days when the sandbar is busy it's large enough for you to still find your own peaceful area away from the crowd we have made many trips out to this sandbar, and every time we fall in love with it a little more. We hope you find this information useful, and it encourages you to experience this beautiful piece of paradise on your next Keys visit. This is Kay Bear. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if so, please like and subscribe to our channel, and you're watching Two Bears Outdoors. Hey guys, I'm Kay Bear. What was I going to say? <laughs> Are you planning a kayaking trip? <laughs> Are you planning a trip? Nah. <laughs> Curry Hammock State Park provides a beautiful <laughs> Dang it! Okay. Are you planning a trip? <laughs>